The Science Fiction and Fantasy Hall of Fame was created to honor the genre's greatest practitioners and the greatest works, but also actual creations, especially the game changers that kind of rewrote the book on what science fiction and fantasy is. This year is also special because it's the first year that the nomination and the selection process has been open to the public. So really now, the Science Fiction and Fantasy Hall of Fame really involves uh, the fans a lot more. Having the physical objects, the, the costumes, the manuscripts, the props, it just, it brings it all to life. You're really reminded that there's these things that people make and handle and, and there are these, these symbols. Each one a little tiny altar in some ways uh, to show off a piece that is, that is super important or, or just super cool. Having a Hall of Fame for science fiction and fantasy is a way both for people who, who love these genres to be reminded of, of what's so great about them and, and what brought them to them, but really it's a place also for discovery. And you can even take a sort of mind reading quiz that will help you figure out what are some science fiction and fantasy works or creators that are really suited to you and your personality. It's really exciting that the Science Fiction and Fantasy Hall of Fame finally have a permanent home, a permanent gallery, an opportunity to display and talk about these creations, these creators, and it's a place people can come and visit forever now. I mean, it's here for good. There really is something for everyone.